everybody. Uh, this is Chad Murdoch with the Murdoch Manwaring Company at Keller Williams Realty East Idaho. We've been hearing a lot of talk and we have on the video call here with us. Jeremy Manwaring. Jessica Carton. Yeah, we have heard a lot about this National Association of Realtors proposed settlement. It's been on the news a lot. We thought we'd address kind of what the main part of this proposed settlement is. And the keyword here is it's proposed. And how is it going to affect us? We're going to spend a few minutes and just talk about that. This, If the judge approves it, nothing will change until July. But we want to talk about what are the things that could possibly change and how how is it going to impact us? So Jessica, yeah. let's chat. Jeremy, let's chat. And let's talk about what uh, how, how does this change and what is it going to do to the buyer? How is it going to change the buyer? Because I think the biggest thing is the buyer is going to have something in writing before they can look at a house. You can't yeah. just call up and say, I want to look at this house anymore. You have to meet and you have to agree to something. So how is that going to play into this market? So I think it's going to be just very similar to what we do in listings. So I go on listing appointments, you sit down, you talk with the buyer about what my services are and how much I charge and are they willing to pay and then agree to that. And then we begin. No house goes on the market. Nothing begins with a listing until we have a signed agreement that everyone has has talked about how that's going to work. Now it's just the way the buyers are going to work. Yeah. So our team and, and since we've been licensed, we have always uh, urged and, and promoted the buyer and agent sit down on the buyer side, not just the listing side, understand what's my role as an agent for you and what can you expect from me and how do I get paid? Uh, nobody really wants to work for free. Um, and I don't think we're expected to work for free. This just opens it up and clarifies for every buyer in the marketplace what, what's going on exactly, who represents me, who's getting paid. So everything is transparent. So, uh, you know, we hear about it all the time and we've, we've been prepared for this for years. Um, and so we're, we're kind of excited now that everybody uh, will start doing the same practice that we have always encouraged agents on our team to do so. You know, you probably hear weird things all over the place. Like Chad said, you know, we, we get questions all the time. Now, what's going to happen? Well, um, it's a proposed settlement. It's a, a rule within an association. Uh, and, and when it changes, it will happen midsummer. And so when, when these things go into place, just be prepared to have more conversations as a buyer in the marketplace with your agent. I don't think that really anybody should worry about it, that there's going to be a big change in the market. What you're going to just see is that I think the public will be affected by it's no more a call an agent, run out to see a house. Just prepare. Now you're going to yeah. sit down, talk about how it works, how they get paid, and decide you're going to hire that agent before you look at houses instead of later down the road. Sellers are, sellers are still going to have to sell. Buyers are still going to buy. Just a little bit of a process. Now you have to sit down if you're a buyer and you have to figure out and, and choose an agent or at least know how they're being paid and have something in writing yeah. and a uh, lot more details, but that's really the bottom line. So anyway, yeah. and if you, if anybody's hearing this is going to affect prices up or down, it's still like Jeremy said, this will be supply and demand. Prices of houses are set between supply and demand and that will continue. Yep. Yeah. Yep. And if you want to read the entire thing, we will, we can put a link in here, call us. We'll, we'll uh, walk you through every detail of it. Uh, but uh, at the end of the day, call us and we can explain more and, and, and how it, it may or may not affect you. Yeah. All righty. I think that's it. We just want to do something quick. Thanks for listening. If you have no more questions, like we all said, just let us know. And uh, thanks for trusting us. And thanks for allowing us to be a part of our local real estate community here. Mm -hmm.